hello guys i'll be putting you through on how to deploy to iroku from your github if you don't have a github account please create one but if you do log into your dashboard and on the top on the top right you'll find a plus sign click on it and click on new repository you put in the name you want to use for your new repository here we'll be using tutorial and leave it as a public file as a public repository and initialize your readme file then click on create repository Just like that, you have created a new repository and to upload the files, you click on upload files, choose your files, then navigate your documents to wherever your file is and click on the file, upload it and click on commit changes. But I already have the files I want to use. I read, it's already uploaded on GitHub. So, I'll go back to my dashboard. Yes, this is what I want to use. Good. After that, you log on to your Iroku. If you don't have one, you create an account. But if you do, you go to your Iroku dashboard. I'm already logged in. And click on new. Click on create new app. And put in the app name. Okay, it says this name should only contain lowercase numbers and data and dashes. Okay. I think we're fine like this. Then you create the app. The next thing to do is to connect to GitHub. After connecting to GitHub, you type in the repository name. Here is SNH. And click on search. You brought up my SNH repository. Connect. So here we have an option for enabling automatic deployment, which means that for every commit you make to your GitHub on that branch, it automatically runs on your Iroku app, on your Iroku. So I'm going to enable automatic deploy. That being done. So, you click on the branch you want to deploy. I'm going to be deploying the SNH version 2 branch and click on deploy branch. It's running and it says your app was successfully deployed. To view the app you deployed you click on view and this is it thank you it's just as simple as that thank you very much for watching this